interact with Diego on a lovely Tuesday morning here at Rankies Fintin. Diego, uh, four rides on Thursday. Um, got some nice rides, I think. Fairly nice rides. Uh, let's start with race two, Octagon. Rested, gelded, and uh, doesn't look like a very strong field. Yeah, definitely. I think the gelding's done in the world of good. Um, I think the distance is a bit uh, short of his best. Um, just hoping to see some improvement uh, after his last run. And um, yeah, just hoping for him to finish the race well. Then race f uh, six, you got Supreme Dancer. Two runs back, uh, ran, I think you beat Twatwa Kat, who came out and won on Sunday. Uh, he's there or there about. Uh, runs a good race and then runs a bad race sometimes. Yeah, um, Supreme Dance, uh, just a bit of a wide draw to contend with. Um, but as you said, that uh, he ran behind Trotro Cut and uh, he beat Trotro Cut and Trotro Cut came out to win. Um, so I definitely think just if the draw doesn't hamper me too much, hopefully he can be back end of Cotets. Race seven, uh, Primrose Path, a little bit of in and out. I don't know much about Primrose Path, but uh, judging by the form, a uh, little bit in and out, um, hoping just to for some improvement. And then uh, race eight, you've got uh, Courageous Cat. Always had a big rap, the sauce. Um, he's coming back from a long layoff. Uh, his work's been good. I mean, I've seen him myself. Uh, unfortunately, drawn a bit wide. Yeah, uh, look, I think he's coming off a long rest. Um, he's got his issues. Um, his work's been good at home. Um, but obviously, you've got to take into account the long rest. Um, he's got the ability. Um, just depends on how he's feeling on the day. So, yeah, we got it from Diego. I think you could, uh, you could have a couple of nice races. Hopefully, Octagon or Courageous Cat uh, could do it for Diego.